the 25th of April 2025 you're welcome back it's a wet morning here it's about uh, half 11 in the morning here my pride and joy uh, when I started up my channel way back in 2009 about there uh, for various reasons I had a new camera and all and it went by the wayside it broke but uh, one of the things I did was to try and make videos on technical subjects and you'll see even from my videos, I still love that sort of stuff. Finding out how things are done and all of that. Um, so one of them was on electrical generation because I found people telling me, oh, we, every unit of wind energy made is one less barrel of oil used, one less bag of coal. And that, of course, is baloney. And in order to try and get that across, I decided to make proper uh, videos on electrical generation and electrical use. A few students have asked me to help them with projects for university and they always get very high marks. I have a good understanding of electricity and I found that very few other people have. So there are three videos. One is the introduction to electric electricity generation on generators. I don't deal too much with batteries. I deal more with the, electri the, the generation of electricity. And then I have another one on transformers and how it's, uh, it's stepped up and stepped down. And it's a good one as well. And these are all practically demonstrated. And then I have the king of them all, one about Nikola Tesla's polyphase currents. And I rely there on a book I bought when I was even a young lad, I was buying books on Tesla, uh, written by Comerford Martin, if I remember. I don't know where it is now, a blue book. And I used the material from it, but I also made the models and put them running there for everyone to see. And I made them here using a big board to hold all the exhibits. So anyway, folks, they're buried in the histories of the channel. But I decided this morning to dig them up and now I have them dug up and I'm going to post them underneath. If everything in this channel is eventually wiped out, I'd like those to remain because these videos not only tell you about electricity, they tell you about my ability to explain it and how to give practical demonstrations. Because if you're bluffing and you'd give a practical demonstration, it won't work. But these are accompanied by a practical demonstration. Now, a lot of you will not like them. You might say, oh, that's above my head. That's all right. But you might have some young person or some student who is going forward. And it, this gives a great idea. You could buy books that height and they wouldn't tell you what, what I have in this. And I've been reading books on technical subjects all my life. And there might be one little thing I'd like to know. And you will not get it. The other day there, I was looking up ones on acetylene generators because it's getting very hard to get acetylene. I was thinking of making a device to, to make acetylene. And I read this book online and I read it all and it gives all the safety. but didn't give one demonstration of a generator, of a small generator. So this is what you get. I find Americans are better. They tend to give it a, 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 a a diagram or explain it better. So it's one thing to know what's happening. It's another thing to be able to explain it. And I have found an awful lot of people bluff. They don't know what they're talking about and they like to feel they do. But in these videos anyway, I'll post them now underneath here. And there are one A, one B and one C. So that's the way they're, 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 uh, they're numbered. One A, one B and one C. And one C is, poly is the polyphase so that's going up now keep it somewhere if you have a drop box or somewhere you never need, need know when somebody say i'm studying electrical engineering and you might say you know i know there's a set of really good videos on that and these are my pride and joy i do say my pride and joy i love sharing them and uh, uh, on this i don't know why i have since i was a child i understood uh, all this real well real well and uh, I remember we had a, a, an engine a four single cylinder Lister engine and I was asking my father how does it make the spark and he explained about the collapsing current and I could understand it like that the minute I heard it I could understand how that worked so that's it and we might make more of them as well now just before I go to folks I was thinking maybe of having my rumble channel for very technical subjects because there's people come on here and they want to see the politics. They want to see what I'm saying about politics. And then they say, I'm talking about gas cylinders. I say, I'm not into that, you know. And maybe I might start uploading on Rumble. And put a link then on my YouTube channel. I don't know what you think of that. Would that be a good idea? There's so many things about choosing a tractor. 
um, maybe on the farm deciding to buy a shotgun or something. And there's so many things you, you I, I know that I could share, but I don't like sharing it all on this channel, particularly if it's too technical. So anyway, that's just an idea for you there. So you might just twitch off this, you might say it's no good, but those, I love those videos. Th those videos will never ever, if I haven't said it, be, be uh, copyrighted or anything. They'll be there for the world to enjoy and share. Because Nikola Tesla had his problems and he was, he had some wrong ideas, but he was a way ahead of his time. I can understand uh, how, how, how he taught and how he taught out stuff. And everyone was telling him, oh, direct current is the way to go. And he was on his own. No, no, alternating current, polyphase, polyphase. And then uh, they couldn't, they found the uh, waterfalls at Niagara Falls and he, they wanted to bring the current down 400 miles from to New York. And then Tesla's was the only way that it could be done and he was proven to be right in his lifetime. So anyway, that's the sort of stuff. Uh, it's fascinating stuff and uh, good to be a part of it. Let me know what you think. Uh, this is only a short video, six minutes. I mean, you can't go wrong there. And if you want to look at those in your times, or indeed youngsters, young, but these are totally suitable for every age, every age, totally suitable, totally, totally suitable. We'll see you back, folks. We'll see you back soon. Thank you very much. And do promote these videos among people who might know about my channel but might like to see them. Bye.